tutorial how to remove a win uh, PC or you know Windows uh, 8 um, from a domain controller. So if you want to take this um, com computer out of the domain to, uh, to be able to pull it to remove it off the system, and it saves you deleting those funny objects in the tree later on, or when you look at administrating your tree, you see lots of weird PCs still sat there. So this is the clean way to remove it from the domain. Um, so first of all, you need to log into the PC not as a user as the administrator of the network where it has all the, the all the rights to remove workstations so the main type in the administrator password username and password so i'm just going to do that on mine and um because you try and remove it from a user point of view users don't have domain access or rights to, to move uh the, 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 the machine out of the domain so you've got to make sure you, you log in with the right administrator levels to be able to successfully do this properly so I always use administrator because it's always a top level uh, domain unless um, the network company who installed this or whether you installed it you used the, the account you've created because I know some people change it to admin support they don't always use the administrator level so once you're logged in we can then look at now um, disconnecting this from the network so let's wait for the menus to come up and it's quite straightforward so that if it if you um, make sure it's still on the same current IP address because it needs to be communicating with the domain um, itself so and you can't and it's always good to make sure this is on the network not off the network so make sure this is plugged into the network it can see the domain it's sitting in so otherwise it won't be successful so as it's all connected up and it's actually seen the domain itself on the network, we go into the menu, right mouse click on computer, click on properties, and it will go straight in here. On Windows 8, uh, you'll probably need to go into side panel because I've got a, a shortcut for start menu to bring back. It makes it much more easier to do this. But in Windows 8, um, go up into the top corner, control panel and then look for system or you can do a search for system and then double click on it and then you bring this menu up here so it's in the current domain I want to remove this out make it a standalone PC to remove off the network so you click on change settings and it bring up the system property box <coughs> and then here we click on network ID now this is this is where you normally join the domain this is also where you remove it from the, the business network so click on the bottom one, this is a home computer, it's no longer part of the business network. Click next. And then wait for it to think about it. And then it'll look at look at the domain, it'll check, make sure you've got access rights and you've got the right account you're logged in there to do this with. And then start removing the objects from the domain, which is now done. So then I click finish, click OK, and it'll prompt for a reboot. So then now do a reboot. Once it reboots, it'll come back being a standalone PC. Which is then ready to take, which is then off the network, and then you should find all the objects in the in the domain tree completely gone. So this is a nice clean um, pull out. All right. So I hope this is helpful. Keep on looking at our tutorials. Keep subscribing. Uh, like us. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. There's got lots more tutorials coming about, and uh, which will be all useful to help you in your job or any tasks you find difficult. We may have a tutorial for you. So I hope you enjoy. Take care. Cheers. Bye.